Hello everyone, this is Matt the Speedstar here, and we're finally gonna finish up the bonus content of Hyrule Warriors. So I didn't really know what to do with Tingle, but uh, yeah, I just decided to go do a rupee competition thing, because you know, he's greedy, he loves rupees. This would be perfect for him. But yeah, I, just, I didn't know what else to do with Tingle, and there was not much else that I could really think of. Also, I have not played as Tingle. So, those levels that you've seen right there, all from Rupees. I didn't want to play as Tingle, because, you know, this could, in a way, give me first impressions about him. And this is an easy thing to do, the Rupee competitions. These are just easy. So, let's see what Tingle is like. I probably should not even be going after the uh, Rogue Forces, because, you know, they have Red Aura, so... If I take too much damage, I'm gonna be hurt. So anyway, while I'm doing this, uh... Brr, Hyrule Warriors, what did you guys think about it? This is like a really good game, do you think all this DLC was good? Is it all interesting in that? I don't know, what do you guys... What do you guys think of the game? What do you guys think of the Let's Play in that? I'd like to hear. I'd like to hear from you guys about it. Now granted, uh... Tinkle... I'm not too into Tinkle that much. What the heck did he just do there? I need to see that again. My god, he's trying to imitate Sonic! <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't... I wasn't really into Tinkle, because, you know, I wanted to get the Let's Play stuff out of the way. Granted, I'm not a, I'm not too big a fan of Tingle. I don't know. He's just not one of those guys I'm into. But yeah, um, I figured I'd at least give him a shot now. Also, uh, I cheated by activating a Ruby Festival because you know I just want to play around. I just want to like play around, just do stuff. Crap, I left those in. Yeah, I forgot to, I forgot to put that back in from uh, last time. Anyway, dealing with a giant boss shouldn't be too much trouble. Actually, what's a special attack like? Wow. This makes me feel... Uh, what am I thinking? His moveset and that makes me uh, think more of the uh, multiplayer in Four Swords Adventures. Wow. That is quite interesting. Ooh, man. Oh, it's Dark Lizard Ghost. I thought that was Rupee Deep there. <laughs> oh, he's funny. He is funny here. He is funny. Oh, this is... Oh, this is a uh, strong attack. Okay. <laughs> well, anyway, granted, I'm not gonna know too much about Tingle, but like I said, this is just for first impressions. As well as just explaining what things are gonna be like afterwards, and here's Ruby Thief. So let's take care of him quick. So anyway, uh, since this is pretty much the finale, I I honestly don't know what I'm going to do after this. I know that there's all that content for Hyrule Warriors Legends coming out soon once the game's released. But the thing is, is I don't want to get Hyrule Warriors Legends. I don't want to get it because it's basically the same game but on the 3DS. And it's pretty much got all the same stuff. Yes, it has more. But I don't want to pay for getting stuff up. How about this? I don't want to get the game for the sake of getting the content that's exclusive to it. And besides, that content is also able to be transferred over here to the Wii U version. And that's why I don't want to get it, because. I 
while I do want to maybe get the content in that, I don't want to be restricted to just getting a game in order to get that content. Well, I'm not going to be able to see his focus spirit attack, but... Did see what his, uh... Final strike was like. Anyway, like back was saying, like, if there's somehow a way where I will be able to get the uh, Legends stuff as paid DLC on the eShop, then I might decide to revive this and do more bonus content as well as just do all the stuff that's available. Of course, if it's exclusive to Legends only, I'm not gonna bother. I'm also not gonna do it unless you guys want to see it. Because, you know, I want to know that I'm gonna be doing this, and you guys are gonna want to watch it. That being said, uh, yeah, just... If you want to see it, let me know. And if I'm able to get it without having to get Hyrule Warriors Legends, then I'll possibly see about getting it. About getting that stuff. Of course, the other thing is I do have other Let's Plays that I will have to be able to take care of before I can get into doing that kind of content. With that done, like I said, this is the f this is pretty much the finale. Um, okay. That is quite a weird line there. Alright, so yeah, we're just about done. We are just about done, and then after this, I'll just talk a little bit, and then I'll end it. And there we go. Granted, yes, I did cheat by doing Rupee Festival, but I was just doing this to just talk and show off Tingle. Anyway, for the last time for the bonus content, victory. One, he looks creepy, and two, that's a pretty underwhelming victory animation. But, you know, just wanted to get it done. So anyway, like I said, that's it. This is all I'm doing for the Hyrule Warriors bonus content. Unless you guys want to see the Legends stuff. If I'm able to get it on the Wii U version. But if I have to get it through... Hyrule Warriors Legends only, like, if I can't get it through the eShop or another way, then I'm not going to do it. Also, I'm not doing Ganon's Fury or the thing with the giant Kuko because... Granted, I don't really like those, and... I don't know, it's just not a thing. I just wanted to do all the characters and that was it. Anyway, that's... that's it, I guess. So, this is it for Hyrule Warriors. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Maybe I'll come back to this someday. If you guys want to just... Want to see me play around some of the adventure mode stuff. You ought to let me know first. I'm not going to do it unless you guys want to really see it. But if that, next time in the Zelda universe, we're going to Twilight Princess HD. Day 1 release, Hero Mode. So, for the last time for this Let's Play, thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like. If you wish to follow along this and my other Let's Plays, click the top right box to subscribe. Any concerns come up, I'll let you guys know on my Twitter, additional info in the lower left box of the video, and down in the description below. This has been Matt the Speedstar, and I will see you guys for when we run through a new Let's Play.